Now then, guys, welcome back to Stras Gaming. I'm Luke. This is episode four of my journeyman save with York City, and we're finally, finally winning. We haven't lost since the last episode you saw. We haven't dropped points either since the last draw that you've seen. We'll go through the schedule. We'll have a look. So, last time out was Billy Ricky and a um, Blythe. We managed to uh, get that win there. And then. We faced Hereford. We beat Hereford 2-0. We then played Nuneaton, beat them 1-0. Kidderminster was 2-0. We played an FA Cup game. We managed to win a 4-0. We've got Geisley today. We've got a fourth round, no, third round qualifying round of the FA Cup against Chichester. And if these two games go quite quick, we'll play the Southport game. So we're just going to get straight into this, uh, straight into this match. This is the team that's going to be lining up to take on... Uh, yeah, Geisley. Sorry, it's early in the morning when I'm recording this. I've just eaten my breakfast and my mouth's a bit a bit dry. So we've got uh, Bartlett in goal, who's been sensational for us. Law, Ben Sheaf, Allen and Ferguson. Ben Sheaf's coming in because he came to me moaned he wanted to play more football. So I said, why not? Okay, fair dues. Uh, Butterfield is the defensive midfielder with Stewart and Hislop. With Harris, Arnold and Parkin up front. Parkin... Probably isn't going to go up front, to be honest with you. He wants to play more football, so I've said, yeah, actually, go go out there and show me what you can do. You're going to have to play as a pressing forward, though. He's not going to be able to do it. We've also got this guy in now. Jim, uh, no, Jordan Bowen. No, that's not the guy we've got. We've got another striker that I bought in. Uh, where is he? I've lost him. Uh, Gordon. Yeah, this kid. Um, he's all right. He's 22, three-star, potential four-star. We've got him in on a three. He's... Pretty much been playing League Two football. A couple of games in League Two. He's hasn't played in the Premier League. He's he's been around pretty much at the higher clubs, so he should do all right in the, at this level. Um, I'm gonna take. In fact, I'm gonna put him on the bench instead of Barrow, and then he can come on at half time. Hopefully, he'll be our new superstar striker. So enough said. Let's get in to this game. So here we are then, the game against Geisley. Geisley, the reason why I chose Geisley, if you haven't seen on my channel, I did try and do a trophy hunting journeyman kind of save thing. Um, and I started with Geisley. It didn't go well. The board didn't like me there. They kept reducing my wage. And it just didn't go well. So I thought, I'll do this game because I need to get some own back on Geisley. And with York, hopefully, I should win this league. I am kind of cheating starting the journeyman off. With York, but again, I just want to get things rolling and see where we're going to go from here. My reputation isn't very good as a manager itself, anyway. Cross comes in, we almost score. Stewart almost gets his third goal of the season. Law's there with a the cross, though. Gets tackled instead. And then Harvey is on the attack, uh, but we do manage to, to stop them attacking forward. Right, corner to us. Law comes in. Butterfield, nice. Ben Sheaf gets his first goal of the season. Bit of a ping pong around the area. I'm still trying to get used to watching this in 3D, but I'm, I'm getting there with it. So corner comes in. Gets nodded down by Parkin to Arnold. Butterfield has the shot. The defender, to be honest with you, tries to clear it off the line. It just ricochets off Ben Sheaf. So he can't really claim that as a goal. He can. It's came off him, but yeah, bit of a dodgy one. Right, highlight to ourselves. Harris picks the ball up. Plays it to Hislop, who shoots and just wide. Stewart has been scoring goals from that range in the past couple of games. He's been picking up a couple of goals. Same as Butterfield as well. He's been scoring from outside the area, which has been nice to see. Next highlight, Ferguson. To Parkin, to Ferguson, to Arnold, to Hislop. To Butterfield, who's picked up a yellow card. Back to Stewart. To Stewart. Out wide, to Harris, to Laws. Crosses it in. Is Parkin there? Parkin doesn't get his first goal of the season. Even though Parkin is our best striker at the club, the veteran striker at the age of 38, he's not picked up many goals. And to be honest, he's not. I'm not really playing a system for him. Um, I'm going to say things are going well, but I know you're capable of better. And then passionately say, you weren't that bad. I've got faith in you. Go out there and do your job. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave him on. Uh, parking on a little bit longer until I bring on the, the new lad, the new striker, Gordon, just to see how he gets on. Right, highlight to Geisley. Hopefully this is, is winning the ball back. Um, I don't think it's going to be that, though. 
kick over the top to Harvey, to Halls. Ball over the top to Reese Thompson. And I know he can finish because he did score a few goals for us in that Geisley uh, save. But it's the end of the highlight. I'm going to make a sub now, though. I am going to bring on Gordon. He is a proper pressing forward. That's fine. Anyone else not performing too great? Uh, Butterfield on that yellow card. I'm going to probably bring on Penn instead. Uh, instead of Butterfield. I'm going to make a double change and see if that changes anything in the game. <laughs> right. Next highlight. Ferguson to Penn. To Stewart. Out to Law. What can Law do with it? Can he get across in? Law, no, he loses the ball again. Law's been doing my head in a little bit. He's maybe our best kind of right back, but he does do some stupid stuff when he's forward. Right, Bartlett to Allen, to Penn, to Hislop, to Stewart, all the way back to Ben Sheaf, to Penn. Right, we're keeping the ball quite nicely here. Right, out wide to Harris. Harris crosses in. Arnold's there. And Arnold, Nathan Arden, Arnold, Managed to head it in for his fifth goal of the season. And it was a very, very... Well, let's say the keeper probably should have done better, really, with that head. It was a bit of a soft ever. But it was really nice build-up play from our midfield and a defence there. Passing it round nicely and then getting it to Harris. Gets the cross in. It just has a nice soft header. The keeper should have done better there. But we'll take it. 2-0. Right, next highlight going on. It looks like it's going to be going to... Guys, they also need to stop saying next highlight. Are we going to win this... Ball, Hatfield to Pulver, to James, to Harvey. Oh, some of these players seem so familiar. Pulver, he's a decent player for Geisley. I don't know what he'd be like for York City, though. Harvey, Hall. I think most of these players as well in this Geisley team are on non-contracts. So I could probably try and, uh, try and get them. But oh, I missed there. Gordon's in for his first chance on goal. And he misses it. Kennedy clears it out. I'm just going to pause it here and I'm going to... Make a change. I'm going to bring on Newton wants to play more football. And I'm just trying to figure out where I'm going to play him. He can play midfield. Newton can kind of play everywhere, which is pretty decent. Um, I'm going to swap these two around, see if it makes any difference. Um, I'm just going to put you as a central midfielder. Newton is a box-to-box. -box. We'll just see how he gets on, playing in the centre of midfield. He... He can normally play at left back. He wants to play more football. He's causing this kind of the dressing room to be a bit angry. So I might as well start playing him. He's okay. He's not the best player at the team. But he can come on when we're 2-0 up. Uh, Newton's going to take this free kick. Finds it Allen to Arnold. It gets cleared. Law picks the ball up though. And just he's got plenty of time. Just find a pass. He does to Ferguson. Ball over the top. No one's really there. Kennedy... To their keeper, it clears it. Hatfield, again, ball over the top again. No one's there. and That should be the end of the game. We've got five seconds left. Ref's obviously going to blow the whistle now. Yes, he is. 2-0, a nice another win. We haven't conceded a goal again, which is good. We've moved up into second place. Did I just see that then? A very nice victory, guys. Well done. Let's get into this FA Cup qualifying round and yes that put brings us up into second in the league this is where we need to be this is the positions we need to be in so with five wins five draws only one loss in the league we should promotion should be nice and easy but we've got Chichester next in the FA Cup third round qualifying so we'll get straight into that so here we are the lineup for the Chichester game we've still got Barlett in goal Griffiths is coming in at right back Ben Sheaf and Huckle is going to be our defensive centre-backs with Newton on the left-hand side. Penn as my defensive midfielder, with Haslop and Stewart as my two central midfielders, with York and Jorginho um, as my wingers. And Gordon's going to make a debut up top. He's going to start. Hopefully he can get a goal for us against Chichester. This a game, This we should be just walking this game, to be honest with you. Um, they're, they're in the leagues below, many leagues below. So we should easily do this one. We should be winning this one comfortably. Pressure's off today. The pressure's not off. Actually, we could do with um, we could do with a bit of a cup run just to get some money in the bank because I am over spending on wages and the board aren't happy about that. They're happy with everything else. They're just not happy with the way I'm treating the wages, which is understandable because we're massively over budget with wages. Right, first highlight though: Newton with the corner. Pick Jorginho picks it up. Has a nice shot. Was that a save or did it just go over? We got another corner. I think it was just a. Uh, a stupid shot. 
Right, next. Oh, hi, let's stop saying next highlight, Luke. Right, York picks the ball up to Griffiths, gets the cross in. Haslop picks it up from the outside of the area, and there we go. Simon Haslop scores a goal. That's what we want to see. Again, that's Stewart, uh, Butterfield, and now Haslop are scoring from them sort of positions from outside the box. And it just comes from across into the box. Their defender can't really clear it. He picks it up and just takes the long shot and scores, making it 1-0. Throwing to ourselves, Griffiths to Penn. All the way out to Newton, to Haslop. It has another chance, and this time the ball is high and wide, and he doesn't score. Chichester now with a throw deep in our area, but Penn manages to clear it. All the way out to Gordon, who plays it to Wes York. And what can he do with it? Wes York running down the ring, finds Penn. To Haslop, who has another long shot. We probably should stop him from doing these long shots. Jorginho has picked up a bit of an injury. Penn is going to get himself sent off. Oh, things can go bad to worse in this game. Penn's been sent off. We've got an injury. That's not ideal, is it? Really not ideal. Um, let's just drop him here for a second. Can I'm just thinking maybe dropping him back. Inverted winger. I'm just going to do that for now. Right, half time's upon us. They've not had a shot, but we have got a man down now. And I'm, I'm going to say I'm not happy with that first half performance. We should have been scored more goals. We should have made sure we had every man on the pitch. And, yeah, we, we haven't. But we are on the attack again. Ben Sheaf with the crossing doesn't find anyone. And now it's going to be Chichester on the attack. And we've just got to be careful here. We do not want to be knocked out of the FA Cup. Already at this round because it's just not good. The board want us to finish, well, at least get to the first qualifying round. And there's another long shot from his slot there. And causing the keeper to work, we do get a corner. Hopefully we can get something from this corner. Newton with the cross in, just a bit too long. Has slot does pick the ball up. Can he find it? He pass. He can. Arnold picks the ball up, plays it to Huckle. And that's the end of it. But we do have a uh, free kick. Newton picks the ball up to Arnold. Hislop shoots again. And he does score again. What a goal that was. We don't mind him shooting from that distance. He's had a lot of shots from there this game. And they are eventually paying off. Arnold just plays it back to Hislop. who just hits it first time. Puts it in the back of the net. 2-0 on the 47th minute mark. This is what we want. Throwing deep in our half. Newton to Arnold. What's Arnold going to do with it? He's breaking forward. Plays it to Stewart. Plays it out wide to York. Can York get a cross into the box? 21. Plays it to Griffiths. To Stewart. To Hislop. Is he going to hit one from there? He's on a hat-trick. No, he, this time he loses it in midfield. And Chichester on the attack. No, York intercepts. Tries to look to Fred Gordon in and it doesn't work. And... It's going to be one of these long highlights. I feel like there's going to be a chance at the end of this highlight. They're playing it nicely at the back. It's going to be a big ball over the top now. Is anyone going to be there? Their striker's in. And Paul Carroll gives them a goal back. 2-1. The game isn't over yet. And we just need to show a bit more passion. And I can't believe we've... I think that's the first goal we've conceded in a while. And it just came from a big ball over the top. And Carroll just managed... He had... Three players around him and just ran past all of them. Going to have to make a, another sub, I think. Um, Defence-wise, have we got a defender on? I'm not liking the way Huckle is. I'm going to get Tom Allen on in defence just to show it up. He's played well for us so far. He can come on there and just... Huckle's on loan. He's. I'm going to blame him for that goal with the ball over the top. Can we stop another goal from going in, though? They are on the attack again. Oh. No, Newton's going to get himself sent off. Newton, what are you doing? Is that just... Oh, my God. We've had two men sent off. Um, off comes the striker. On comes Ferguson. We, don't, we now don't have a striker on the pitch. No, that's not going to work, is it? 30, 30 minutes I've got to play without a striker. I'm just going to put the wingers on attack, maybe. This is ridiculous. Two men sent off. 
Oh my god. Uh, I might have to try and control play, but I don't know how this is going to work. We have no strikers. Ball over the top. They're going to equalise. No, Bartlett does make the save. They've got a corner though. Things are not over yet. We've got to hold on now. We really do. I don't know what to do. I might just... I need to change the tactic. I really do. If we've made the save, what's going on here? Right, okay. Free kick. Big kick up top, but there's no one there. I'm going to have to make changes. I'm going to have to go to the, the control possession, I think. That's what we're going to have to do. Oh, I don't like this. I really don't like this. Two men sent off. Newton's tackle was just ridiculous. Penn, I can kind of... It's two yellow cards. But Newton was just ridiculous. York's there, but there's crossing. We've managed to get a goal. Nathan Arnold manages to score. The two wingers combining with the cross. We've managed to break on the counter. Made it 3-1. And York just beats both of the men around him. Manages to get the cross in. And Arnold's there as an inverted winger. He puts it in. Makes it 3-1. That's his sixth goal of the season. And yes, I want to make the changes. The changes haven't been made yet. Let's just try and keep possession now. We've got a throw in. It's right near the end of the game. Hopefully, come on ref, just blow the whistle. We've somehow managed to scrape our way through this match. And there's a couple of players that have massively let us down. Two red cards, an injury. It's it's not been good for us. But we should hopefully come away with a 3-1 win. The, 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 the guys that are on the pitch still deserve... A medal for doing that, but I'm going to be. We got away with that. We did. What do you mean? They were look stressed. We had two men sent off. We got away with that. I tell you now, we got away with it. Right. So what we're going to be doing next? I'm not going to be doing another ep another game because that one just went on a little bit too long. Schedule wise, when are we going to be back? I don't know when the next round of the FA Cup is going to be. It's probably going to be. I don't know, actually. I'm just going to keep playing, and I'll be back maybe November. I'm going to try and get through the first season fairly quick. Um, we'll just see some of these games. We are where, where are we now? End of September, so we've got all of October to go. I may play all of October. We'll come back and play maybe Leamington, FC United, maybe, in December. I'll just see how, how many games I play. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like. Let me know down below how you think I'm going to get on, which team do you reckon will come to me first with this massive run that I'm going on at the minute. The first goal I've conceded in how many games? One, two, three, four, five, six games. Chichester are the, are the team that scores against us. So yeah, let me know how you think I'm going to get on. Let me know how long until I start getting poached by other teams above us. And that's it, guys. So thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next episode. I'll see you later on.